everybody and welcome to Uprising 144K. I'm Hydrogen Man. Okay guys, today I'm gonna show you how to make hydrogen chia seeds and basically how to really get proper and really good hydration because these guys really help. I mean, they have a bunch of good nutrients and I've gone over all the benefits on other videos in the past, but they also are really good at hydrating you and I'm gonna show you how to do that today. So this is what we're gonna do guys. First, you get a jar and I'm gonna take some hydrogen water and I'm gonna put just a little bit in there though. Let's see, about this much water. All right, and then what we're gonna do, is you're gonna open up the organic chia seeds. I also prefer organic stuff. And I'm probably gonna get about this much, this little scoop here. And what's gonna happen is I'm gonna pour it right into the water. There's a reason that I'm doing it in the order I'm doing it because otherwise it gets stuck on the sides and it just doesn't work quite right. So what I do here is I'll actually use a stick. Make, the reason I'm doing this, and I know I'm gonna be losing a little hydrogen when I'm doing this, but it's okay, we're gonna add more. But the reason I'm doing it like this is because I don't want things to clump together. I really wanna make sure that they're not clumping so they're absorbing the maximum amount of water. These are awesome because when they get all nice and plumpy from all the water, they carry a lot of water into your colon. And so they really, are really good with hydration. I mean, you can use them in many different ways. I actually put them in my smoothies quite often also. But anyway, so let's see here, guys. So first we stir it like that. And I got a little bit on the stick here. There we go. And then what we do, you know, you can actually even stir them a little bit like this. And you can see that some of them are getting stuck on the sides. And so what I'll do is I'll, I'll just move them around, push them down like that. But okay, so then what we do is then we pour a little more water after doing that. Hydrogen water specifically, because these guys are also gonna be absorbing hydrogen and water. So it's really gonna enhance them a great deal, make them, uh, make them even more hydrating than they ordinarily are. Of course, I'm using very clean water also. I've actually distilled the water and then I added some minerals to it. I'll put the links down below for that because people are always asking about how I make my water because it's literally the best way, the cleanest way to make your water. So it really is the best. All right, I'm kind of scraping all these little stuck ones on the side. All right, and it actually looks quite beautiful. I don't know if you guys can even see it, but it looks like, to me, it looks like lavender floating around the water. Okay, so then what I'm gonna do is one more time because these guys are gonna soak up a ton of water, which is exactly what we want them to do. So I'm gonna add even more water and there we go. Pretty much towards the end here. Take off a little bit of the chia seeds that got stuck to my chopstick here. And let's see what we got here. All right, oh, one more. Okay, so now, I'm gonna stir it a little bit more. Again, I know we're losing a little hydrogen doing that, but check it out, guys. Now it's all ready to go. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually just gonna set it down and I'm gonna probably let it sit out for about 12 hours. Sometimes these little guys can also sprout, which is also even more amazing. And then I'll put them in the fridge and I'll just use them little by little, whether I put them in, you could even just put them in with hydrogen water. You can put them in with, um, for example, in the smoothies, that's something I personally like to do. And you can just put them in all sorts of beverages. I mean, again, they have a bunch of good nutrients. They even have protein in them also, but they're just really good at hydrating you guys. And hydration is incredibly important, especially as you get older, guys. Most people are basically chronically dehydrated. So I kind of hope that showed you how to make some a hydrogen smoothie. What I'll actually do too, probably in about six to eight or 12 hours, I might add a little bit more hydrogen water again. And then all these guys are just gonna be completely plumped up with water. And uh, maybe I can make a video next time and show you the end result, but this is pretty much what they're gonna look like. I can see that they're already absorbing a lot of water. Look how pretty they look too. <laughs> All right, guys, hope you uh, found the video helpful. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time on the next video. Oh, don't forget to like, subscribe, <laughs> and share. All right, till next time.